Hi guys, well, I'm going to be reviewing the Jaws Steelbook today, and um, I thought I'd start it off with just a, a few uh, moments that I spent at Sea Life in London. This absolutely fantastic aquarium, which contains sharks, um, it's got like a, a reef tiger shark in there, it's got like um, the, the great big turtles, um, it's got like even like small little fish uh, from Finding Nemo in different little tanks, and you can just walk around it and look inside and see these massive sharks. And when you walk um, walk in, as you saw in the um, early part of the of this clip, uh, you can actually walk over a glass floor and you see the sharks swimming underneath. It's a fantastic uh, day out, and you can get it. You can get there cheap if you use Tesco points, which we did, um, or you can you know find deals on the internet. And uh, it's just great to see these these wonderful big fish swimming so close to you I definitely recommend it guys anyway on to the uh, Jaws review hi guys um, got a lot of steel books to review but um, for me this is the one of the most important films I've been I've been looking forward to coming out this year along with the Indiana Jones blu-ray box set um, and the fact that it's a steel book had me like so excited about um, it arriving and I couldn't wait to um, put it in uh, the Blu-ray, knowing um, you know they've done the full restoration job on this film. Uh, so I've been looking forward to this coming out for a long time. I have to say the actual steel book itself is is fantastic. It looks great. I love the simplicity of the um, just the poster on the front with the word Jaws. You know, just like the poster was way back in 1975. Um, it's kind of coming out a blue colour on my viewfinder. I don't know what's going to come out when I upload it, but the actual um, uh, C picture on this is more of a bluey green. Um, but uh, I think it's a great, it's a great looking cover for the steel book, and it's plain on the back, which is a bit disappointing. I think it would have been nice for a little something, but um, better plain than having loads of uh, information that you don't need or age ratings. Um, the image goes around as you can see, there's, it's not, not a sticker book or anything. And um, unfortunately on my spine, I don't know if you can pick this up, I got a little scratch down the middle again. I have contacted Play about this and they've been really good um, with their after service and have promised me they're going to sort this out, get me a pristine copy and um, I'll have this one replaced because I said to them, I've let this go a lot, a lot, a lot of times. I've received a few of these with the scratches down the middle, and uh, I just don't want it with this film. I want, I want this film in perfect condition. And uh, the guy kind of understood because uh, he's a collector himself, so um, you know, I'm glad he understood. I know it's only a minor thing, but as I said, I've, I've let it slide before. Uh, what can I say about this? Um, the picture on this, um, it's it's fantastic. It's um, great. It's it's like watching it again for the first time when you see this on Blu-ray. The the colours are so vibrant and uh, everything looks so fresh and new again. And uh, um, it's just uh, it's just definitely worth no matter how many copies you have got on laser disc or. If you've got on DVD, it's just worth going out there and getting this again because it's just it is getting the you know the restoration it deserves. And um, this film's got everything. As I said, it's got scares, it's got humour. It's about human, you know, about people. It's about relationships. It's about dealing with all type of emotion, fear, uh, anger. Um, <sighs> everything you know it's about the the relationships of people and the shark really is is something that um is is something that just sets all this off the shark's not really the shark is not really the most important thing about this film in my opinion um Sp spielberg just you know f filmed um the town where the, this the shark attacks are based the way he's filmed it is just it feels real i mean where the people their their main problem is uh the kids karate chopping the picket fences and 
and little stuff like that just makes makes this movie such a gem. Uh, wonderfully acted. I mean, when the the movie goes from um, like horror where people are being eaten by the shark into uh, three men on a boat, um, just the change of gear just is it's just as great as as what's been before if not if not that's the greatest part of the film and uh well what can i say i mean the extras in here are great as well you you definitely get a lot of documentaries a lot of interviews um i'll open it up and see the inside artwork there you as i said you get a lot of uh, documentaries interviews you get um, a whole set, uh, another documentary called uh, The Shark Is Still Not Working, which you just get on the Blu ray. Um, you get l lots of other bonus features, uh, deleted scenes. There seem to be more deleted scenes in this than there was in my DVD. Um, outtakes, storyboards, Jaws the Restoration, the original trailer, and uh, Audio is some good audio on here. There's English DTS HD Master, French DTS H uh, High Resolution 7.1, Italian, uh, the English is 7.1 as well. Italian, Spanish DTS Surround 5.1, English, French, Italian, Spanish DTS Surround 2.0 Mono. And you get subtitles, you get English, uh, French, Italian, Spanish, Danish, Dutch, Finnish, Icelandic, Norwegian. Portuguese and Swedish and uh, nice picture disc as well by the way just take this uh, out here so you can see the inside uh, didn't get the, uh, I know there's a digi book out but I do have the uh, memories uh, of Martha's, Martha's Vineyard um, I think that the digi book basically like got excerpts from that book uh, but uh, overall really happy with it and um, as I say, it's it's a must-have for any Jaws fan. I'll catch you later, guys.